Thank you for tuning in for another DIY project. Today we are making felt succulent plants and your felt succulent plant will look something like this. Um, if you obtained a craft kit from the library, you are going to have a glass bowl um, or a succulent bowl that looks something like this. Um, and today we are going to be working with a pot that looks like this. You are also going to need preserved sheet moss, smooth foam balls, felt ribbons that you can find at Hobby Lobby, hot glue gun, a knife, And what I am going to do is paint my pot because it looks a little plain. And then for your smooth foam ball, depending on the size of your plant, um, your pot, either you're going to make sure that it fits in there. So either you can leave it whole or for the smaller one, what we did was we cut it in half and it's quite easy enough to use a knife um, to split it in half or you can use scissors if you need to. Just something sharp to cut it for what we're going to use today, we're going to actually leave it whole so that it fits. And what we're going to do now is we're going to work on our flower. And since we have a blue pot, I figure we can use a white daisy. So we're going to start working with the smaller base first. And we're going to use our hot glue gun and we're going to apply some glue along the edge first. We want to keep applying the larger flower base around. 
So we want to go ahead and attach more glue. To begin applying where we left off. fits pretty good on the inside so we're going to now we're going to take hot glue and place it around the outside of the soft foam ball and then press the soft foam ball down into the pot not move and a little blue and then take some sheet off So once we've made sure that the sheet moss has fit around the pot, we're going to attach a layer of hot glue to the bottom of the sheet moss and firmly press down on the soft foam ball with the sheet moss to attach it.
hand. Lastly, we're going to attach our flower. applying some glue along the bottom And voila. New felt succulent plant. So feel free to try one at home. And I hope you enjoyed today's project.